Welcome to this video. Here right now you can see the output of a SAP query and in this video I would like to show you and explain to you how you can add an additional com column that displays an icon based on a condition. And to do this, first of all, you have to open up the transaction SQ01 to maintain your SAP query. Then you have to go into the change mode and then you have to go to the next screen two times. So either hit this button two times or the F6 key. So to, yeah, to display the select field. And within here, first of all, you have to go to edit and then short names and switch on off. And here basically you have to, uh, yeah, to, to define a short name to those columns or to, to this column that you would like to use in your condition for your icon. And in this example, I would like to use the purchase order number, so put the Ebeln. And in this case, I'm just using LV underscore Ebeln. And then I save it. And then the next step is that you define your local parameters, so your local field. So you go to edit, and then local field, and then you have to go to create. And then this window will open up and here within the short name, you define your uh, yeah, your short name of your icon column. So in this case is LV underscore icon, a little description. So for example, icon, and then once again, also for heading here, um, because in the uh, info set, I have just one field group available, but if you have multiple, then you can select the field group to that you would like to add your, uh, your, your icon column and then it's important that you select icon and in the calculation formula here within if this condition is true then basically your icon will be shown and here right now i would like to just display the icon incomplete um, yeah if you would like to get to know how you can uh, get to know this icon name i will link a video based on all of icons and here within a condition i basically just would like to uh, use the LV able and in my case if it is yeah greater than uh, the remainder of 2000 for example from from the number range four and five but that's just an, an easy uh, example and then you have to continue so then you have created your local field if you would like to make any changes after that then you can uh, set the focus to this local field and then once again on edit and then local field and then change and then you can make any changes later on and yeah basically then you have to save and what is uh, important that the this icon will be shown you have to add it to your basic list so you have to click on this basic list button and then here you have one additional area for your local additional fields and then you have just simply select the checkbox on the fields displayed in list and then we will save this and once we've test this without any variant and then we execute it then we can see right there where the condition is true so for every line with a purchase order number higher than the ending of 2000 then this icon will be displayed and yeah that's a really easy way how you can add icons to your SAP query to your output of your SAP query um, if you like this video hit the like button if you have any questions questions left put that in the comment section and do not forget to subscribe this YouTube channel thank you so much and then see you in the next video